hey guys welcome back to another windows 10 mobile tips and in today's video we are going to talk about something related to routing and some about the windows registry tools so and this is Windows 640 xl and uh, yesterday itself a new software application has been launched called interop tool and that has been available uh, now freely available not in the store but itself in somewhere else you can use that app and let me tell you what is that app all about so this if you guys have must heard about the registry so or you might have used windows uh, desktop ever so windows registry is a set of uh, tool or software that has all the you know starting from the low end things to the high end and all the keys and mappings and important low, minor details to any of the you know uh, major details all are stored in the registry so you can simply access that by uh, opening the command prompt or typing registry edit regedit as you can see it will give you some warning in a windows one so you can do that so here is the registry editor so any of the application software you install on computer uh, it goes everything has been mapped or all the details have been stored in the registry and now since uh, windows 10 is common for both the phones and mobiles so technically uh, it was there on windows 8.12 but uh, it was somehow limited and it's completely hidden but uh, xt developer peoples have now uh, made a tool and it has been rolled out now you can easily use it before that they were also tool but they need to uh, interlock you know, unlock your device for the complete capability then you can use that but this tool doesn't require you to run any tool that can unlock the capabilities so already i have posted that information on my app cell phone so if you guys have that phone you can definitely go and check that so just go to the section here uh, under the apart collection go to the apps games updates you will see a new tool called uh, this routing tool interrupt tool so uh, all the most popular websites has covered this information so then i have just taken information from some other website and link is put in the show more notes down there too so you can see uh, using this tool uh, you can get the registry editor browser and some uh, secure ftp transfer protocol so now let me show you guys uh, tell you what exactly uh, with this windows 10 where registry stuff so uh, by using registry you can do lot of stuff on your phone for example uh, with couple of days back uh, microsoft has made it two separate paths uh, the fast uh, inside the fast ring uh, for the new phones and lower end phones uh, or the phones that are not eligible for fasting they are getting 10 5 it's blind so using some hacking tool and modifying the registry you can install the register build already have tweeted an image for lumen 630 i have installed that but somehow that is risky and that can uh, get your device on the damage state so i just uh, didn't put the video because it was not recommended because anybody of you can get in trouble or lose your my precious data so here is the one now uh, who is this for so especially this is for uh, for the people who are known as a developer or who are working for some advanced feature need to test that something internally or if you have some spare of windows phone that you can want to just test and install that and let you know or just to check the features of the windows 10 mobile or any of the stuff maybe computer geek, geek or guy if you are there but make sure to back up that device but anyway strictly i'm not recommending to do that if something bad happens or you might lose any data so please don't blame me don't dislike this video because i just for information purpose i'm just telling you guys and where to find this tool so this tool is publicly available by the given link if you just click here uh, you can get that this is very uh, less than an mp size and i will just show you guys i have copied to my onedrive so you can easily get it i will put the original link in the show window so you can read there so uh, to install that you need to do a couple of the steps first you need to go to the settings and go to the update and security here you go to for developers you need to enable developer mode then you can sideload apps because in this way you are going to sideload app you are not going to download and install any app from the you know windows store so this is called sideloading so just enable that developer mode and turn on the device discovery and device portal is optional you can turn that off or not so it depends on you so once you did that and use the above link to download that tool and uh, by default uh, it downloads to uh, download directory so open file explorer and uh, you should be there if you have selected this uh, device memory so go to the memory card and uh, because i have selected here so under downloads you will file this uh, find this file name called interop tools app uh, 00.20 arm so you can also attach that file to the emails also it will work perfectly from there and if you just uh, you can see i have a couple of tools here called root tools and double windows phone tweaker release so these are some of the free open tools that is a lot of feature but uh, these tools are installed as an application and it has something else 
it doesn't need interlocking capability to all these things you just click on that app it will ask you to install would you like to install interlock tools from G this is the username uh, the uh, twitter username that guy that has developed that tool now uh, it should be installing so we'll wait for a couple of seconds and uh, by default for this tool it is not going to any of your you know app drawer app listing you, you won't find that here it will go and directly add it to your settings so let's go and check that so under the setting you need to go to the extras and click on extras you will find a new tool called interop tools you can see just click here interop tools if you just open you will get this stuff so this is the stuff you will get and now let me compare it with the windows registry so as you can see and so guys please don't do anything with stuff and one important point you can install into any of the redstone build phone or any of the 10586 branch phone and this is uh, lumia 520 i have also able to install it there you can see uh, you can see under the extras you will see an option called interrupt tools so it is available in both the phones but don't try it until unless you really need that this is just for information purpose i'm sharing you guys nothing else it's not credited to me and you will get a couple of the options like register editor registry browser secure file transfer protocol so this is a file transfer protocol that is used to share file between using ftp for example http we are using to browse the internet and ftp ftp double colon slash and ip address you will use so this is an advanced feature i will look on that and let you know so just browse uh, registry browser and you will see here an h key class root here in the computer too you can see first one and second one is the current user and uh, we also have here and local machine we have here and sq users as you config as i said guys uh, uh, since both are windows and mobile but features and functionality may vary and uh, depends on the what kind of hardware and resources available so uh, by default here we've seen some extra option we are not sure for what these are all about but uh, most of things are common here so this is how you can see uh, you can manipulate any of the option but i'm not recommending and until you don't know don't do anything else uh, neither we neither microsoft nor any other vendor will take responsibility of that this is completely on your risk and decisions just for information purpose because after that i'm just going to uninstall that i'm not going to keep it that and uh, this uh, we need to work that enable unlisted sftp access so uh, and also you should not try because you're not going to use that you need a completed setup for from the you know desktop itself too so see why for right now it is beta software so it may crash it shows correctly here welcome to interrupt tools temporary name the name can be changed to tab is currently in beta and bugs are expected you can report bugs via dm or direct message to a feature session in twitter account or telegram so uh, lots of stuff here so you can do that and uh, uh, register editor if you open that it will show you guys key and path and value so uh, don't do that because i also not going to try that but this is how you do that guys and for more information use the wikipedia app or website and just try to read windows registry if you really want to do something else make sure to go ahead and try something in the background what is that all about then try on the backup phone take your take your backup and do all those stuff then now let me show you guys how you can uninstall that to simply uninstall that you cannot do that from here because it's not visible to app draw so again go to the setting and under the system under the storage you will see in, uh, if you are by default selected device memory then click on this device and this is the call uh, i call it is app manager uh, just copy term from the symbian system so apps and games and just take here uh, do some sorting to find that app before sort by installation date So sort by installation date does. We should get that. You can see uh, we got here uh, interop tools and uh, install on 7th May. So you just need to click here and just select install. It will uninstall from here. So you can see uh, I'm not even going to try that because uh, I even though I like to do all this stuff, but I'm not going to take my spend and a lot of time there because it's not really needed for us. So in this way you can uninstall that now if you go under the setting and check that so it has been removed from here so this is all about this guys and other things like uh, uh, don't forget to watch this may 2016 part one uh, apps and games week for this uh, windows phone windows and mobile so you can see you can create a lot of cool uh, stuff says so this week uh, i really find out very good app so you can just go to my app cell phone and you can watch that app video itself uh, under the uh, best apps collection you will get that video here you can watch for the demo and also to get all the download links of the app you just need to go inside this hot collection section and app skins updates you will see here best apps may 2016 part one also you can get the same link here uh, inside this uh, 
apps updates okay guys so that's it for this uh, quick tip and information if you enjoyed that video guys hit the thumbs up and don't forget to try all the stuff it's really very risky this is sort of behind the scene and thank you very much for watching i'll talk to you very soon have a nice day ahead